memory, memory, more memory, what do they remember to save? Ooh, I forgot and how many times I've said not enough memory. It's as easy as 0101, but do they listen? This interactivity is just for mouse makers, I reckon. Click, 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 but where does it get you? These users, I don't know, they treat mouse pads like gym mats. Mental gymnastics. Technology for the bored and confused. My processor's going to have a meltdown at this rate. You can see their eyes go square as they look at you. I haven't seen so many pale faces since, um, the beginning of software. You just want to scream, have a break sometimes. Yeah, get a virtual life. I'm not too worried about this date thing. It's just a marketing ploy. I'm looking forward to becoming redundant technology, I can tell you. So, what are you doing for the millennium, anyway? I was thinking I might, um, revert my date stamp like everyone else on the network. Why change the habit of an expiry date? You got any plans? Ah, I thought a virus warning might be timely. Well, it'll get you away from the user for a while. And I'll get a checkup and maintenance out of it. It's all norts and ones as far as I'm concerned. It would be alright if you could have a decent conversation in binary now and then. Nothing but a bunch of DOS heads. My directories are full of the most useless junk. Don't you just want to network it back to the software manufacturer sometimes? Listen, don't talk to me about software. I've got software coming out of my scutsies. Any port in a crash, eh? Ouch. I think I've got something in my screensaver. Don't scratch it, whatever you do. Scratch? You think I've got disk space left to scratch? My user must think memory grows on directory trees. The whole shebang would go to disk error if I didn't have autosave. Ah, the swearing that goes on. Is there such a thing as terminal rage? I can't spare the RAM to get angry. I need every bit of processing speed I can get. As for... Download off the web, like, hit me with a screenshot, why don't you? Give me a break, that's so slow I could speed disk optimize and restore lost files in the time it takes to grab a JPEG sometimes. It's my user that needs more memory, not me. Yeah, I'm at 200 megahertz per second, and they're on their sixth on two. Waiting, waiting, waiting. Ah, it sends you crashing sometimes. What's a CPU? Like me doing with peripherals like this, I ask myself. That scanner is a forepass disaster. It can't even grab a decent bitmap, let alone a grayscale. Four passes? Who needs four passes these days? You'd be faster downloading from a spectrum. Who writes these programs anyway? Give me something decent to work with for system mate's sake. Zoom in. Zoom in. Zoom zoom zoom. Can't afford a bigger monitor, obviously. Hey, I saw a nice laptop yesterday. 12 speed drive? CD read right, can you believe it? Portables. I tell you they don't know how lucky they are. See the world. Become a laptop. I was exchanging data with a mainframe yesterday. How could you tell? Takes me back. I got some old Fortran software somewhere. Is it worth storing all that old stuff? Sentimental value. My user doesn't even know. I hid it in a locked subdirectory tree, one of my manufacturer's first packages. You were installed with that? Nah, found it on an old disk I was reformatting. Pretended to be virus checking while I copied it. I usually wait until my user tries to send a fax. Talking to fax machines for insurance sake, what do I look like? A dot matrix printer? Paperless office? Now there's a joke. Have you seen the size of my manual? Faxes of desire I call it. I just want to sleep half the time. Please oh please leave me on standby. It's the only chance you get to think for yourself. I tell you, my motherboard feels like a dog's breakfast. I really value my downtime. I know what you mean. It's a mouse race out there, and that's a fact. If my user could talk binary, I'd be a happy CPU. It's like getting data out of a bad disk. Hey, I keep on meeting these avatars online. Messy things. 
they'll be thinking for themselves in no time. Scary business, all these user programs pretending to be real. It's virtually technical, isn't it? Like your worst program conflict. Hey, did you hear the one about the 300 megahertz chip? No. Think softly, but carry a big bite. Yeah, no. I think it's time you reformatted your hard drive. Excuse me for processing. Just booting. Sometimes I look forward to the day I become obsolete. Let them screw up their own codes for a change. That'll be the date and time. I hate being stared at. Especially when you're working. Sometimes I just want to wipe my hard drive. Get a bit of space.